Make sure you watch this entire video for an absolutely free breakdown tonight, February 9th. Last night in the trenches of the middle of the night, we posted our hockey play. Let's hope that comes through because we're sitting right now at one and two on the week. We need to win today. So we have a hockey game already posted. Make sure you check that out when you're done with this video if you haven't already. This is our second game of the day. Ole Miss versus Alabama, an SEC basketball matchup that we like. We're going to dig into it, but before we do, guys, subscriptions, please hit that subscription button. It's easy, and it's like being part of a cool club, but the even cooler club is the comment crew in which the shout-outs I will get to in a second. And then if you want to be part of the easiest club, you click the like button. That's for, that's for the lazy guys, but I still appreciate it. And then if you want to be in the most beneficial thing for yourself, you hit the notifications, turn the notifications on once you're subscribed. This way, if we post a game a couple hours before game time, you're not going to miss it because you're going to get that notification. Now, before we dig into the game, shout out time, very important time. Billy Rockefeller, shout out. Brandon Hairston, shout out. Greg Meyer, shout out. Spencer T, appreciate it. Shadow Bahamian, I gave you the email address. Let me know when you're ready for a t shirt, baby. Greg Meyer, shout out. Um, Waterboy, shout out. Brandon Hairstron, shout out again. You commented a few times there. And Brandon, it's one game. You don't got to give us the SMH, but I still love you. All right. So that's that for that video. Let's see on this one. Gloria K. Alexander Carr, shout out. Waterboy, shout out. Vance Sosa. All right. I love all you guys. Comment crew. Um, I got to get a comment crew shirt made. Something cool just for the comment crew people. I'll probably do a comment crew shirt. That's actually a great idea. It, it, that's how ideas happen, guys. I just had it. So I'm going to do a sports profit shirt, but it's going to be specifically for members of the comment crew. What an idea. All right. So um, you got to keep pushing me, that guys, because sometimes I forget about things. All right. So Ole Miss hosts Alabama tonight. Ole Miss is 12 and 11, 13th in the SEC. Alabama is 14 and 9, 8th in the SEC. Both teams are coming off losses, looking to get back to their winning ways tonight. The line is set at Bama minus 6, total of 143.5. Ole Miss is coming off an overtime loss to Florida. They were very close to 10-point underdogs in that one, and they played them toe-to-toe. -to -toe. They return home. They're 10-5 and five overall at home. This is the first meeting with Alabama this year. They've played some close games this season, even though they haven't been able to convert to wins. So they only lost by nine to Auburn, Auburn and Arkansas at home, and those are two of the best teams in the conference, if not the best teams in the conference. So I don't think Ole Miss should be scared of the Bama team. They're 11 and 12 against the spread this year, 7 and 7 against the spread at home. Now, in seven of the last eight matchups, they have beaten Alabama at home. Key number there. Alabama, two game losing streak. They lost to Kentucky at home. They were favored in that game and they lost by 11. Questionable favorite, but it was a poor showing by them. They shot three of 30 from the three point line. You can't do that and be okay. They usually make nine threes per game. So if that's not on, they have no chance of winning a game. So check for that three. Alabama is 8-15 and 15 against the spread. 1-5 and five straight up on the road. 1-5 and five against the spread on the road in their last six is not good. They've only covered two out of their past 13 games. Alabama is the better team, but they have been struggling, and they cannot cover spreads. They're a weird team. They beat Baylor and Gonzaga but they've lost to Georgia and Missouri. So they're just very inconsistent is the best way to put it. They hit the road tonight, face a decent team in Ole Miss. Ole Miss plays well at home. They've shown that they can compete with the top teams in the SEC. Alabama is a middle-of-the-pack team. I think that they're going to be overlooking Ole Miss in this game. They play Arkansas on Saturday, and they're going to take this bottom-ranked Ole Miss team for granted. Tank Ole Miss – Plus six, baby. Lock it and clock it. And go ahead and, like I said, subscriptions, notifications, 
And if you want to step up your game a little bit, comment, crew. And if you want to take the easy way out, hit the like button. I love you guys. I will see you either later tonight for NHL or tomorrow for more College Hoops. Take care.